One of the most annoying summer pests are undoubtedly mosquitoes. Well, a research institute in South Korea says they have come up with a solution to curb the number of these annoying insects. And it's environmentally friendly on top of that. Our Kim jong sil provides a glimpse of this technology. One of the least welcome guests in the summer months that bothers people day and night. The mosquitoes. If only there was a simple way to curb their numbers. We went out to hear what people had to say about this tiny summer party crusher. When I go to a mountain, black mosquitoes bite me unless I move around constantly. They bite so much it hurts. When I come home, I feel so itchy I have to wash the bite marks off with water. I get bitten all the time, so I prepare repellent and stuff like that more than other people. I have it in my house, and I also use a mosquito net. But there may be a solution on the horizon, as one research institute in Seoul says they have found a way to control the number of mosquitoes that's better than using chemicals. The institute says it paid particular attention to the fact that mosquitoes can pass through spaces as small as two millimeters. Since Seoul is a large city, we paid attention to damp, humid places around residential areas, and sewer manholes and ventilation pipes for septic tanks came up as prime suspects. Manholes or septic tank ventilation pipes provide the perfect warm and damp conditions for female mosquitoes to lay their eggs. These places are also filled with germs that are potentially dangerous to humans. The research institute says using rubber like this or nets like these can fill gaps so that fewer mosquitoes can escape from sewers. Another advantage, they're cheaper than using chemicals. The rubber seal and the gnats cost somewhere between 3,000 to 10,000 Korean won, which is roughly 2 to 8 U.S. dollars. The chemical that each district office in Seoul uses can cost up to 150 million Korean won, or roughly $110,000 per year. So how do we actually use these nets and rubber seals? First, the manhole lead needs to be opened. Then, the rubber seal should be placed to fill gaps before the lead is closed again. Also, on septic tank ventilation pipes, the exposed end of the pipe can be covered with a very fine net. This way, mosquitoes are unable to escape. The institute tried its method at 400 buildings within a one-kilometer radius of the Sangamdong neighborhood in Mapugu district. It said 220,000 mosquitoes, or about 48.9 percent, were kept under control simply by closing or covering gaps. The researchers said they will now recommend these methods for areas in Seoul that have the largest mosquito populations. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.